Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Gray here. Give me a sec. Fuck yeah. Sliced him into my big ass fucking almost buster sword looking motherfucker over here. So yeah. Hi. How are you all doing? Hope you're doing well. I've been away for a couple of days, but I am back. I am ready to take on the Water Temple. The temple that confused so many little 90s kids like me. Back in the day, this temple was just brutal. And I don't know what the fuck I'm doing over there. Fucking pissing about with that. We're fine. We don't need to bugger about. Let's get my fucking iron boots on. Go for a nice walk along the bottom of... I nearly said the lake. It's not a lake. It's just a lump of water. Or lump. A pool. I don't know. Not good with the terminology. But thankfully, I'm not paid to be. I'm paid for very little. And very little as well, I am paid. So, whatever. We're good. Boots on. Again. I have to hookshot my way out of this. And... Wait for it to appear. We good. I think this is the way I gotta go. I'm not sure. I'm just checking every room in the fucking... Nearly said house. Dungeon. Whatever. I can't remember what the fuck I was doing. I was here last time. That was fine. Sod it. We're gonna hop in. We're gonna have a look around. Just to be on the safe side. Just to be thorough. You know what I mean? So yeah, I hope you're all doing well. We're going to take this fucking temple down today. I have no doubt in my mind we're going to get on with it. Like half an hour, boom. It'll be knocked out and done. I've already got the first two keys, which is like, you know, oh, the only hard bit in the whole damn temple. Getting key number one, right? That's always tricky. Nah, no, I have been there. Fuck it. We're good. Right, last time, I swear. Last time flip-flopping back and forth all over the place. We are fine. Let's hookshot my way out and go check the next room. We'll be fine. So yeah, I really hope you've all been well. I've been busy, visited my brother in hospital recently, that was good, you know, not to bang on about my own personal life and my own videos or nothing, but yeah, just fucking knackered today though, I just want to sit and play Ocarina of Time. Trying to get around London at the moment is a nightmare, I swear to god, it just, I, oh, I do not feel fucking, what's the word? I'm losing track of my own train of thought now, yeah. I would not enjoy living in London right now, in the middle of the coronavirus situation, that is not fun. Thankfully, I don't have to. I just have to visit every now and then, so I should probably stop complaining. Anyway, so, iron boots, down we go. Let's have a look. We've already got two keys, so that's a big chunk of uh, the trickiness of this temple taken care of. And then we've got to get some more. I'm certain there's more about. Can't remember where for life me, and I don't know why I'm bothering killing this fucker for. No, 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 not that one. There we go. Fucking Navi trying to interject herself into my own personal vendetta against that weird blade clam thing person. Sushi. It's fucking food now, so why not? Right, up we go. Ah, oh, yeah, I remember this bit. Kind of. Vaguely. Hell yeah. And then we just fly over there. Not a problem. Kill these motherfuckers. Oh, I do love this sword. Like, fuck the shield. You do not need a shield. You just need a nice big ass sword like this. There we go. See? It just fucking reaches through the bars and everything. It's not a problem. Unless there was another sculpture there. That's always fun. Gold one, obviously. And there we go. No surprising that's it in this room. But hey, gold sculpture is valuable, I guess. Especially if I'm going to try to do a 100% run at some point in this playthrough. Not now, obviously. Just later in general. Okay, so down you go then, Link. Take a deep breath. Or not. Somehow that blue tunic feeds oxygen to his cells. I don't know how it manages it. It's magic. It's Hyrule. Just go with the flow. Believe it when they say it. And I've just realized that my little face is blocking off the map. You guys don't need to see the map. No one follows the map. I don't even have the compass, so there's no fucking good having it and trying to navigate it. You just won't get nowhere. Right. So, this was the one where we met Princess Ruto, wasn't it? This is where we adjusted the water. Yes, it was. Brilliant. Fantastic. Fucking awesome. I have explored all the rooms down here with the water at the lowest setting. So, nice and thorough, we're done. That's all you gotta be with this game, alright? You know, to figure out this temple, you just gotta be somewhat pragmatic and, you know, think fourth dimensionally, Marty, obviously. Nah, it's not too tricky. As of like a seven, eight year old, whatever, it was impossible, alright? This temple, I'm sure there's a lot of kids that watch this now and just think like, you know, oh man, that doesn't look too tricky. And truth be told, it's not. It is kind of overhyped as a difficult temple, but back in the 90s, before you could Google everything, you had to figure it out yourself, man. Like, you know, back in my day when I was a lad, 
Shit was tough. So here we go. Like this bit. This took forever to figure out as a kid. Just you go down. You raise the water level up, you go down, and there you go, there's a little room, there's like a whole other thing going on here. What's going on down here? It's mental. Having some sort of rave back here or something, but yeah. Like, it took forever to figure these things out. It was slow, it was painful, but such is life. Right, so I blast that, and then I've just got to hookshot all these motherfuckers to death. And there is enough of them. I managed to shoot a lot with like one blast or two. That was pretty cool. Boy, they're keen on me having bombs. What am I gonna blow up underwater? Bomb shoes might work, maybe? Probably can't launch them though. That fucking thing was in the way. Come on. Come on. Oh fuck, I accidentally fired it. Is it? There we go, we good. That one is on the right, I believe. Yep, it kind of pointed me in the right direction before deciding to point anywhere else, just to fucking throw me off. It's like, no man, you're gonna earn this third dungeon key. Or small key, whatever. It's only a puny little key. Even the game's not impressed by it. There you are. Yeah, that bit took like, I don't know, it seemed like years back in the day, but it was probably fucking minutes to find just everything seemed to take forever as a kid it really did you know you got a game and you feel like you've played it your entire life when you look back over it you know when you're an adult and all that but uh, it was probably just a couple of weeks or something I don't know but then be fair a lot of games that I played as a kid I only got around to completing them when I hit my early 20s like Lion King on the Sega that shit was hard as fuck level 2 Christ that is not something a kid can figure out I was playing it recently, actually, just, you know, killing time or whatever, trying to relax, and because I was a bit distracted, because I got a bunch of things going on, you know, I just sort of fell out the rhythm of it, I was like, actually, where the fuck is everything? I got no idea, those monkeys fucked me over for 20 minutes straight while I tried to figure it out, it was mental. Oh, I need the long shot for you, don't I? Fine. We'll go get a special weapon to kill you with. Right, where am I exactly? Uh, I hear monsters. They're converging on my current location. They really want my blood. I'm fucking ready. The bigger on sword. The gift that keeps on giving. It never stops giving. It really doesn't. Right, here we go. Oh, got a little bit of wind kicking on. I don't know why. That hurts. It'll go away soon. Once I've smited my enemies, I'm sure. Can I hit that from here with a hookshot? No. What about now? Yes! Result! Huzzah! Oh, there it was. Sorry about that. Is this the compass? I'd really like it if this was the compass. I know it's not a fucking long shot. It is. <gasps> it's the compass! I never saw that coming. What a pleasant surprise! Be fair, in this dungeon, it helps quite a bit. It actually does help you figure everything out. Ow! That... that looked painful. That's a time where you wish you were wearing iron boots outside of the water just to protect the feet. No, oh well. Too late for that shit now. Right, now next. We need a long shot for you. I gotta remember that. We go here. Fuck yes. Now this is the bit I think that confused so many people back in the day and gave it like its legendary difficulty status because you open that with the one key, right? And you need another one to open a bit further on down. And if you haven't taken the time to find all three, Game over, man. You just sit tight forever. Alright. Fire. Open up. Man, that bit of wind's really kicking my ass. I'm professional. Or at least I can try to pretend to be one on camera. Fuck you. Never stood a chance. I love carving through them like they're made of fucking tissue or something. Just nothing. Fuck. I'm getting confused now. There we go. We's good. We elevate the war again, and then the real fun begins. Fuck yeah. Right, so... Ah, oh, it's not that bit that used to confuse the fuck out of me as a kid. Hold on, I'll find it in a minute, I'm sure. No, in my luck, I'll have forgotten how to get through it, so I'll be talking as if I'm all above it and beyond the difficulty of this legendary temple now, and then I'll just fuck it up and be like, um, I have no idea where to go. Do not Google it. Do not Google it. Nah, I'll probably be alright. 
I already got the one extra key, so we're fine. And down we go. And this one pays off later. Yeah, that's the bit where you hook shot in, isn't it? Just checking to be sure. Yep, okay. Well, long shot in. Can't do it with the hook shot. So yeah, we open this up. No problem. And yeah, we come back for that later. It's probably a fucking heart or something, I can't remember. Probably useless, but hey ho, what can you do? Right, Kakiri boots, why not? Don't you love how they grew with him? When they said you'll grow into them, they really fucking meant it. And we're good. So, it's that one done. And then, where we gotta go next? Ah, oh, I think, yeah, I know what I've done wrong. Mm-hmm. Yep, I have done it. I wasn't as thorough as I would have liked, so, get that. Then we got that, but there's a door at the other end with a great big fucking lock on it, so, we gotta go back down. Shit's kicking off. Right, I think I gotta go all the way around again, don't I? Yeah, I gotta drop the water back down, and then, alright, okay. At least I know what I'm doing, right? I've caught myself after one mistake. That's not too bad at all. Fuck you guys. I'm gonna attack in a guy as he's just drifting towards the bottom. Right, yeah, we gotta lower the water again, raise it up to the middle, then come back. That's what we've gotta fucking do. I don't even need to check my map to know, I just know. Right, here we go. We raise ourselves back up. I can completely respect the 3DS remake for switching the uh, the iron boots. You can just click them on and off. See, there we go. Like cracking the wall. Got to blow it up. But yeah, that sounds incredibly useful because it does get annoying after a while having to pause, do it. Like it only takes seconds, but after you've done it a million fucking times, it does piss you off somewhat. We're not logical creatures, us human beings. I'm certainly not. Right, here we go. Drop down. No fall damage, love it. And then here we go. Let's raise the water back up a little bit. Just the one notch, you know. Good, 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 good. Alright, where did we go? Ah, not you. There you go. And there you are. No, there you go. Oh dear. Ouch! Fucking impaled myself again. That's two now. I want to be keeping track. There we go. Okay, right. We're good. We're good. So I'm gonna do this. I get the other fucking key or whatever. And then we crack on. And we go to the place where we know we've obviously got to go. We've got plenty of time. We can get it done. It's not a problem. Hopefully I should be able to get it done within this one part. I really hope so. I don't know why. My pride won't allow me not to. If this part becomes an hour long, it becomes a fucking hour long. You know what I mean? Right. So, yep. It's the one. Isn't it? Yes. He's fucking back, isn't he? That bloody blue tech type motherfucker. He's gonna try to knock me off my high horse. Aha! Fuck you! I was ready for you, mate. Too bad. Uh, no, we don't do that yet. What the fuck am I doing? I'm losing track of my own plan. I already articulated it perfectly to all you guys, and now I'm fucking backing out and doing random shit. That's not smart. Bad Gray. Very bad Gray. Here we go. Oh, excuse me, that's more wind coming out. It's not even burps, it's just wind. I get it when I forget to chew my food properly. Sometimes I just get too eager. Especially bread and shit like that. It's really weird, I found one bread recently that doesn't seem to do it so much. It's a fucking Weight Watchers bread. I was so embarrassed when I picked that up off the shelf. But there was no other bread in the shop, alright? And just, yeah, but it was actually pretty good. Doesn't really cause that problem so much. And it works great for doing French toast as well. It works really fucking well. And I do love French toast. Okay. 
It's probably because I've been trying to get into fitness stuff more recently. I've been watching random videos on YouTube for like cooking ideas. Just generally, what are you aiming to eat more often? Just alright, make bread that has more protein in it and stuff. Because you know, I'm figuring there's another lockdown going to kick off. You need something to do to stay sane during that. You know, so I figured, yeah, buy a couple of bits of exercise gear. I got an old weight set from when I was a teenager that I never managed to pursue properly. So yeah, I've been doing that. It's good. It's going well. And yeah, French toast. Mmm. Good discovery. But yeah. Anyway, so... Excuse me. I told you, man, it's coming out. I did not chew thoroughly enough. Yeah, I should do. Probably the salmon I had. It was just frozen shit, man. I'm not exactly living life to its fullest over here. Like, oh, salmon. Yeah, frozen shit. Straight out of a packet, man. It was delicious, though. Alright, come on. Down you fucking come. There he is. Oh, denied, motherfucker. I love cutting enemies in two with this thing. I just really do. I was drawn. I was always drawn that way, just a two-hander sword. I always preferred it to like, you know, a sword and a shield. It always seemed to me like the best defense is a great offense. So just cut the fuckers up with a big ass sword, and you don't need the shield, you know. Depends on the game, though. But for the most part, yeah. Unless you can wield two swords, in which case, even better. I think Lloyd, what's his name? Irving? Irvine? I don't know how to pronounce. From Tales of Symphonia, sum that one up best. Just, well, if one sword is an attack power of 100, two swords is 200. It's a dumbass idea, but, you know. Right, it was this way, wasn't it? Yes, it was. I should do Tales of Symphonia at some point. I'd have to emulate it, though. And the funny thing is, on an emulator, I don't know why. I'm certain you can fix it, but everything runs at double speed. And, oh, okay, I see. I was waiting for it to move, and it doesn't. But yeah, the frame rate, just on, like, the field and in battle or something. I can't remember, but yeah. In certain places, he just moves at double speed. Now, that was it. In battle, it was normal. And on the field, he moves twice as quick as everything else. And in towns as well, I think. And everything else seemed to behave properly. It's just odd. Whoops. There we go, we good. And we're out! Fuck yeah! Yep, that was the bit that fucked me up for ages as a kid. I have very distinct memories of staring that bit down. It's like, how the fuck do you get a key? You literally just gotta go back to that room near the start. That's it. And I'm not, like, lecturing. I'm sure other people have figured it out themselves, you know what I mean? But yeah, it really fucked me up as a kid, so I just... Sort of admonishing myself for not being smarter, you know? There you are. Bring it on. Oh fuck, he did manage to jump up. Fair enough. I didn't expect him to. Looked like a bit of a jump for me, but whatever. Yep, over we go. Oh, now my favourite mini boss in the game coming up. This one's just trippy, because it comes out of nowhere. She's like, yep, Dark Link. You kill him. It seems so strange, the tone, it, like... Because they don't explain it any more than just, well, you know, it's Dark Link. Beat your dark side, whatever it is Navi says. Oh, fuck. Ah, oh, the little bitch fucking dragged me under. Ah, oh, it's gonna eat into my goal, trying to get through here in half an hour. Oh, he's fucking dead now. Great. But yeah, because they never explain it further, just it's Dark Link. You figure that warrants some more explanation. Because none of the other enemies in this game are shaped like Link. Why that one? And just, now you kill him, you kill him. And then you're out. That's it. Weird. Always threw me out when I was younger playing this, and even now, because tonally, it just seems very disjointed from the rest. I mean, you know, you make that point about the forest temple, and I did, at length. It's just so weird, you're like, forest temple, it's like a creepy haunted house. And it's great, but it's just odd. Alright, here we go. And then I think I'm gonna need my bow and arrow out, and I... Yep, there we go. Din's fireworks pretty good on, was it Shadow Link, Dark Link, I don't know what title they went with for him, but it works pretty good, but nah, I'm fighting without it. I threw it that way. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, yawn. Ugh. Right, now that one. You can go above him, I think you can... There we go. He's down in one as well. Love it. You gonna give me money? 
Hell yeah, red rupee. Love it. I live for that red rupee. And yeah, it gives you a shitload of magic. Don't know why. So yeah, we wander in. Weird fucking place. Just odd. It's like a hollow deck or something. Then we go all the way to the door, and we can't get through. It's like, oh no! Where will we go now? Exactly. What do you want, Navi? What? Strong iron bars are blocking the door. You, yeah, thanks, Captain Obvious. And there he is. It's like, what's that? Oh no, it's Terminator Link. Dark Ray, conquer yourself. See, no explanation whatsoever. Yeah, like, you know, he's kind of meant to be tricky, but you just literally slash the fuck out of him. You can only block so long, you know? It normally works a lot better than this. Well, that worked well. Come on, you motherfucker. I never remember the best strategy. I normally just slash the fuck out of him. It seems to work fine. It's working less effectively than it normally does at the moment, actually. I'll blame the camera. It always has an impact on the gameplay in ways you just don't expect. You do everything fine, and then the second the camera starts blaring, you just fuck everything up. It's brilliant. Easy. I love how manly his shouts are as well. It's not like Link's just, eh, you know. It's like a err sort of sound. It's a nice change of pace. I guess. And here we go. Long shot. Hell yes. Incoming. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Nah, 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 nah. One more item down. Thank you. You found the long shot. It's an upgraded hook shot. It extends twice as fast. So what do we do with damn piece fucking hook shot? Chug it away. We don't need it. Spotting a pattern with Link, haven't we? It's like, ooh, new shiny thing. Don't fucking need that old one. No, be fair. No sentimental fucking value attached to damn piece hook shot at all. Like, fuck him. He's an asshole. I look forward very much to going back in time and solving his bloody puzzle. And why didn't that work? Hmm, she's misbehaving. Come on. That's too low to whistle, that one. Surprisingly low pitched tune there. Alright, we good. So, I just fucking hop in, I think. Oh, what the fuck do you want? I'm gonna swallow by the vortexes. Yeah, thanks, no, man. All the vortexes I've seen in my life that I charge right towards, I really needed that fucking warning. Fucking fairies, man. Do you think it works? For start screaming, I don't believe in fairies. Probably not. Navi's probably like the exception to the rule or something. She feeds on that shit. There you go. Finally. Blast him. Gimme. Thank you. Right, now. Oh god, it is tricky to get around a lot of these. Right. How the fuck does this work? There you go. Over there, probably. There you go, make it to the edge. You're good, Link. No, I remember that always fucking happens. That's it. Edge your way away from it. Hell yeah. Um, oh, I gotta get over there. Oh, fuck you, game. Here we go then. Jump in. The water's great. Can I float out, or is this how it gets you? I think this is how it gets you. No, that was easy. Alright, never mind. Nothing to panic about. And then we hop over. Not a problem. Another key? Hell yeah, we need it. And then that takes us somewhere else, doesn't it? Oh no, we've been here. We have. That's good to know. What a relief. Right, now I've got to try and remember where to go next. And I can't quite off the top of my head. It's not going to be that tricky though, is it? 
No, that didn't count. Just slightly clunky to aim. It's like, fuck it up like an idiot. Here we go. Right, we're looking for the big keys. We can get access to the boss room now, as long as we got it. So, we ain't got far left to go, I don't think. Uh -huh. Oh, that's fine. Or not. Whatever. Hmm. I'm getting pissy because I can see that time limit fucking moving in. It's not going to happen, is it? Oh, there we go. Let's have a look around there. Uh, where are you? There you go. We head north, not a problem. Whew, dear me. Ooh, getting yawny. It's because it's warm in here. Don't know why. Seems to have that impact. Right. Ah, oh, yeah, I'm a this. Now we just fucking... Could fucking take the boots off. Or oh, I think we can just, yeah. Long shot our way out of here. Cool. Ah, fire, damn it. Oh, yeah, here we go. Just keep him on. Just drop in there. It's fine. I love how quickly he can jump up, even with those boots on. He's like, yep, hop up. I run really slow just to catch him all off guard, and then right up when it comes to it, you know? Weird asshole. Uh oh. There's a lot of them, and because there's a lot of them, I can't Z-target to get away from the vortex. Like, I just want to look ahead, not stare at them all and swim in circles. It's not even letting me on target. I should've just killed them all. I'll just swim straight across, I'll be fine. There we go. Right, I really want to kill all these pricks for that annoyance. Bring it on, line up! Yeah, you better fucking wait at the back. Oh, they're scared now. How come he can't aim? It's not hard, is it? And you, you're dead. I know I'm wasting time. Thank you for reminding me by thinking it all in your heads. And there we go. Right, where next? Think... I think we need bomb shoes for this bit. Well, maybe I just ran out of regular bombs back when I was younger and needed it or something. Yeah, like eh, fuck all of you. Yeah, push that at the end. Won't take too long now. We're getting there. Cool. Blow this motherfucker up as well. It'll be great. Cool. What the fuck am I going over here for? I gotta go over there. Oh. Never mind. Thank you, Navi. I'm gonna just pull it loose a little. And now we go over there. Much better this way. Cool. I think the water level rises after this, which is bundles of fun. That's all we need in the water temple is more water. Keep pushing, Link. Pooh, dear oh dear. These little bitches fuck me up while I'm trying to do this. I'm going to get very irate. And I love how it waits till it gets to the end and just falls in at a perfect 90 degree angle. It doesn't just like tumble in and get stuck. Cool. And out we go. Oh, I'm gonna fucking kill you. Yeah, you get back in the wall. I'll leave one alive so you can tell the other fish what happened here. Okay, cool. The fuck am I now? Not out yet is what I am. And there we go. Just get out, Gray. Not worth fucking about with them. Right, I think, yep, gold sculpture. So many that are so easily accessible in this game, it's great. In this temple in particular, anyway. There we 
go. And I think, I think down here is what I'm looking for. Ignore him, fuck it. I'm on the clock. I'm already late. Yeah, the ship has sailed. So I've got all the cutscene to get through and everything. Oh man, the water temple fucked me around. Oh fuck, it's still- Oh, Jesus Christ. That'll have to do for now then, guys. Thanks very much for joining me. Really hope you enjoyed the part. And yeah, don't worry, we'll get this game done soon enough. It won't take too long. We'll get this water temple nailed and then carry on. So, cheers again. Really hope to see you very soon. Catch you later. Take care till then. Bye.